The Colville Covered Bridge in Bourbon County has been a scenic spot since 1877, a photographer's delight. But legend doesn't always paint a pretty picture. There are stories surrounding the bridge that fill many people with dread. Its remote location gives it an eerie ambiance on a cool October night. Now's the time to come forward. A group known as the Bluegrass Ghost Chasers recently came to investigate the tales of spirits trapped in the timbers. Any folklore stuff, there's always just a little bit of truth behind them, so you just never know. They arrived with all kinds of ghost hunting gear. This is one of my favorites. Voice recorders, meters that measure electromagnetic fields and temperature changes, even a teddy bear equipped with a voice box that supposedly responds to invisible touches. Do you want to be my friend? This might seem like scary business to some people, but these investigators have no fear, just a desire to have a ghostly encounter. You go doing it knowing what could happen. Uh, sometimes you may get startled, but not scary. If you really get scared and trying to help people, you might want to try doing something else. At least three mysteries are tied to the bridge. Supposedly in the early 1900s, a man hanged himself in the middle of the bridge. And in the 1930s, there's a story of a young couple who came down this road after a dance. The car was going too fast, missed the bridge, and plunged into Hinkston Creek. Both of the young people drowned. Sarah Mitchell, are you here with us? Another story centers on an elderly woman who was walking through the bridge, had a heart attack, and didn't come out alive. Usually, if the air feels heavy to me or my heart's pounding with the heaviness, I know there's something here because you can feel it. These days, people say they see strange shadows in the bridge, or sometimes lights suddenly shine up through the floorboards, as if coming from headlights in the water below. Nothing that dramatic happened while the ghost chasers explored. Can you give us a sign you're here? But when they played back their voice recorders, they say they heard an unfamiliar laugh. <laughs> and when they were at the end of the bridge farthest from the recorder, they picked up a whisper that seems to say, No one can hear me take a few pictures. Supposedly drivers who've gone through the bridge over the years say they've seen headlights come up behind them in their rear view mirror. But when they looked over their shoulder, no car was there. It's as if a phantom car veered into the river. Whether you believe or not, this is a great place to experience the spirit of Halloween. You can get a thrill as you cross over the bridge and wonder if there are spirits who haven't crossed over to the afterlife. There's something here, but it's afraid of us.